Don't throw rice away. Make this amazing and delicious Brazilian farofa. Click the like button already and comment if you liked this recipe. In a large saucepan over medium low heat, add one teaspoon of unsalted butter or margarine. Once melted, add 200 grams of bacon chopped into strips, one Calabrese sausage chopped into strips, and stir until golden brown. When that happens, add one medium onion chopped into small cubes, two crushed garlic cloves, and stir fry for two minutes. After this indicated time, move all the ingredients to one half of the saucepan, and to the other half, add six beaten eggs and stir just like this until the eggs are scrambled. This is the right cooking point. Next, add one half small cabbage chopped into thin strips and keep stirring until wilted. Leave us a comment with the name of the city from which you're watching this. I'd like to give you a shout out and thank you for sharing this recipe. Now, add one half red bell pepper chopped into small cubes one half yellow bell pepper also chopped into small cubes, two tablespoons of sliced olives, two cooked medium carrots chopped into cubes, and keep stirring. Have you downloaded that recipe app on your phone yet? It's already available for download. I'll leave the app link for download here in the comment section. Go ahead and download it right now. Now, for seasoning, add one teaspoon of salt one generous pinch of black pepper, and stir until incorporated. If you've made it here, that means you're enjoying our recipe. So click the share button and share this video with all your friends. It won't cost you anything, but for us, it will make all the difference. Once you've done that, add two cups of cooked rice, two cups of cassava flour, and stir once again. Finally, turn off the heat and add chives and parsley to taste. That recipe is ready. You may now serve and enjoy it. I really hope you liked this recipe. Now I'll head back to the comments section and we'll continue to answer everyone who left the name of their city. And I'll also thank you for sharing this recipe. See you next recipe. Bye.